Martha Pollack is the 14th president of Cornell University and professor of computer science, information science, and linguistics. She took office on April 17, 2017. President Pollack has embraced the one Cornell vision and strongly believes that a Cornell education must foster the joy of discovery, set students on a path for lifelong learning, and teach them to seek the truth assess evidence and determine the reliability of information. Pollock was previously the provost and executive vice president for academic affairs at the University of Michigan. It is my pleasure to welcome to the stage President Pollock. Thank you, Scott, and good morning, everyone. It's uh, really a, my pleasure to take part in my first entrepreneurship at Cornell Summit and to welcome all of you. Um, across all of Cornell's campuses, entrepreneurship is thriving. Cornell Tech, I hope many of you have had the opportunity to visit the campus. Uh, generating startups there is a key focus, and it just opened its new campus on Roosevelt Island in September. Up in Ithaca, students are using the eHub co-working space day and night. And students from all the colleges and schools on campus are involved in the university's entrepreneurship ecosystem, whose many activities are supported by entrepreneurship at Cornell. Each year since 1984, the university has presented our Entrepreneur of the Year Award to an outstanding Cornellian who demonstrates not only remarkable business achievement, but also community service and high ethical standards. It's my honor to introduce this year's recipient, whose entrepreneurship and philanthropy are equally extraordinary. Robert F. Smith, class of 1985, founded Vista Equity Partners 17 years ago, and in that time, it has grown to manage $30 billion in capital. Vista oversees a global portfolio of 50 software companies that employ more than 45,000 people. As chairman and CEO, Mr. Smith guides Vista's focus on enterprise software, data, and technology-enabled solutions. Just last month, he was named by Forbes as one of the 100 greatest living business minds. He studied chemical engineering at Cornell, where he designed his own co-op program, and he went on to earn an MBA from Columbia Business School before working at Kraft General Foods and then at Goldman Sachs in tech investment banking. There he played a key role in mergers and acquisitions involving such major companies as Apple, Microsoft, and Texas Instruments. Mr. Smith has shown a deep commitment to using his resources to benefit others. Last year, he personally, and through the Fund2 Foundation, of which he is the founding director and president, gave $50 million to Cornell to fund chemical and biomedical engineering, to support African American and female students throughout the College of Engineering, and to create a fellowship program at Cornell Tech. Cornell named the Robert Frederick Smith School of Chemical and Biomedical Engineer Biomolecular Engineering in recognition of his generosity. Mr. Smith's philanthropy extends far beyond Cornell and includes the largest personal gift of $20 million to the new National Museum of African American History and Culture at the Smithsonian. His public spirited service includes chairing the boards of Carnegie Hall and Robert F. Kennedy Human Rights, as well as serving on the boards of the Boys and Girls Clubs of San Francisco and the Bay Area Discovery Museum. Just this May, he signed the Giving Pledge, which commits to giving back the majority of one's wealth. At Cornell, Mr. Smith has served on the Engineering Advisory Board, and I am delighted to say that he recently joined the Cornell Tech Board of Overseers, where his expertise will be extremely helpful. Mr. Smith, your leadership and thoughtful, so socially responsible philanthropy mean a great deal to me personally, to the world, and to Cornell. As one of the university's most distinguished alumni, you set an outstanding example for our students by demonstrating the extraordinary impact that Cornellians can have across the nation and around the world. So on behalf of the entire Cornell community, it is my great honor my great pleasure and my great honor to honor you, Robert Smith, as the 2017 Cornell Entrepreneur of the Year. Thank you. 